Hello everybody and welcome to Spyro the Dragoo. The Dragoo. Gonna go ahead and start it up. Fun little fact that this is being played on a PlayStation 3. Because I did not know PlayStation 3s could play PlayStation 1 games. And all of them do. It was just for some reason they just removed the PlayStation 2 playback and cutscene. Okay, rolling. Oh! It's been peaceful here in the five worlds, or is it six, for a dragon's age. We now have 12,000 treasure, or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Ganort character? <laughs> now I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. He's an alchemist. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple creature. Simple. He has been contained in a remote world is no threat to the Dragon Kingdom. No threat! Besides, he is ugly. That does it. No threat, he says. He's ugly, like he says. And yet, do they ever explain why Spyro never got hit? Is Ganasty Ganork just a horrible aim? It's like, that's nasty, Nork. I know. I am mocking them. Hello everybody, this is the game, a legendary game of wonderfulness, Rescued Nestor. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about Nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. What do you mean that's all you can tell me? Kind of cryptic. Oh yeah, I forgot. I just have to relearn the controls. But yeah, this is one of my favorite games, and I just figured, eh, since I can easily do it now, because while we're collecting gems and doing this uh, simple running around tutorial level stuff, I might as well tell you what my original plan for <laughs> recording it was. I have a PlayStation 2, 1, and 3, and I did it out of order because I'm a stupid. But before, I was planning on recording it on my PlayStation 2, but for whatever reason... No, 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 no. <laughs> His eyes, they stare through the rock. Eh, I have to get used to the control. What are you even doing? Really wish I can use the control stick. For uh, the camera movement, but uh, I was originally going to plan on you know, doing this on my PlayStation 2, but for whatever reason, my PlayStation 2 had trouble doing it, as did my PlayStation 1. Whenever I tried to play a PlayStation 1 game, they would always never show on uh, my my capture device. No, no, they would show on my capture device, but wouldn't show on my TV screen. Oh, eh, do it again. Do you do, do the idle animation again? Or is it acting like he's on an edge right now? What? That was weird. I guess seams in the world, if placed correctly, mimic edges. Come on, do the idle animation. Oh, well. And the music's gone. Because I wanted to do the idle animation. <laughs> Come on, you just did it, don't you? Might as well do that. A nice little detail. Silly, but cool. Hopper. But, oh yeah, uh, yeah, for whatever reason, back when I was trying to record this on PlayStation 1 and 2, it would never show up on my TV screen, only my capture device. And, Freed Delbin. I wonder how they got the names. Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch him. Keep your horns on, Spyro. You have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Um, it's my his health name bar. Is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Not Keep really protect. Well, see what I mean. Kind of, I guess. Like he's protecting you, as in he's my meat shield. Even though I get hit, he takes the damage through magical shenanigans. But yeah, uh, as I was saying, uh, for some reason it would just have this weird thing of just not recording properly. 
And I would, luckily I have this like third party multi cord that's, I have no idea what the other consoles it's supposed to be for, but uh, it could be used on PlayStation 1 and 2. So when I was trying to record it on PlayStation 2, I would just have S video and one audio go to the capture device, uh, while one normal video and one audio goes to my TV. But once I realized that uh, PlayStation 1 games play just fine on PlayStation 3 without any shenanigans in the setup department, it's like, this is just so much easier. And yeah. They don't really explain that much, but this is in a simpler age. Then again, this is on the same console as Metal Gear Solid 1. We'll get to that. So, who knows? Thomas. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. And, and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Hmm. Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. Where do the dragons go, anyway? Because that's the one thing that's weird about this, is like, I can't tell you. You must realize, it's basically, basically what they're saying is, You must realize your destiny, Spyro, but we can't help you along that way. Except for these itty bitty pieces of information. It's like, for whatever reason. I'm coming for you, bandit man. I'm coming for you, bandit man. Ow. Also, why didn't this ever get an HD remake? I mean, this is one of the, like... Isn't this supposed to be one of the touted, uh, great PLA Station 1 games that lots of people like? I mean, I know it got sequels up the wazoo compared to other ones, but those sequels are subpar. And don't worry, we will get to them too. At least all but one of them so far. Dang it. Have to go back up. Go back up. These just look so good. Oi, oi, oi. The camera is stuck within the walls. Whoop. So yeah, it's just a simple platformer with, uh... Well, I wouldn't say it's a simple platformer. It has its moments. Ooh. Ooh. But I just like it. Dang it. Oddly enough, this did not happen in the tests. Because this also suffered ever so slightly from the same thing as... My, um... Uh... Blah, blah. Kingdom Hearts Let's Play, where the audio would get distorted if high-pitched voices talked or certain sound effects played. Nasty Nork really set off the... wait. But there's a po oh yeah. I shall gather up all the gems of this area. Sim considering that this is a much simpler platform, I am most definitely going for 100% on this one. Compare this to stinking Kingdom Hearts of its stupidness. Argus. Oh, Flash, do that again. The, the others did the same thing. A portal in the Dragon Mouth, but you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Only one of them. Oh, let's go. Also, I don't know why, but kill sheep, get butterflies. Off we go to the world! Entering Stone Hill! So yeah, let's go on treasure collecting glory hunting. While killing monsters and turning them into gems. Really wish... there we go. Charge him down! Uh. The dragon's horn is mightier than the ram! Bop. Now, if you've watched, like, a Digital Gaming's episode on Spyro, one of the things they wanted to do with this game was to have the enemies interact with the uh, player character, unlike other games of the time, such as good ol' um, uh, Crash Bandicoot. Don't worry, we shall restart that soon. Oh yeah, that's another thing. This is a restarted Let's Play from a long, long time ago. Mainly because that was a kind of amateurish era of myself that I wish to kind of reboot and do greater justice than I did back then. 
with more talking, less silence, and more progress. With oh, when you find a dragon or step on one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. That could be useful if you run into trouble. Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. That audio cut off just a little bit. Fire the audio engineer. But yeah, this is a, a reboot of a Let's Play because older times. Uh, in fact, that is how. Uh, and also back then, I used emulation. The naughty boy I was. Hoidy hoidy hi hi ho. But yeah, I have uh, all. Uh, ba I have basically every single console Spyro game minus the final legend of Spyro the Dragon. Shut up, you egg-stealing little bourgeois bunk. Bunk. You can't stop the dragon. You can't stop the dragon. You can't stop him. I find it funny that these guys, who are just old men standing in a field, are are harder to get through than the rams because the rams you just plow on through but the old men ah, you bounce off but yeah what i'm saying oh yeah uh i'm just bouncing all over the place with topics i need to keep stay forward so yeah uh enemies actually interact with gilgus gildas Oh, my friend, how about a hint on gliding? Sure, you what do you bet. got? For the longest glide, press the X button at the top of a jump, and try pressing the triangle button to drop down in mid-flight. Okie dokie. I forgot that the- I always forget that that's a thing. But, yeah, the, they decided to have the enemies actually interact with the player, which is kind of cool. Uh, unlike games like Crash Bandicoot, where enemies are just static and ever so slightly interact with the player, this one was made more to directly interact with the player. Shut up. Give me my sunny side. Give me my sunny D. Thank you. Yeah, but this is from a simpler age of platformers. Back when platformers, uh, well... Just were platformers. You just went around collecting things, and the satisfaction of collecting things was satisfaction enough. Granted, this is also on the same console as uh, Final Fantasy VII. Well, hey. Ah, uh, well, I, actually, speaking of Final Fantasy VII, if Final Fantasy VII can take forever to get an HD remake, so can Spyro. Spyro deserves an HD remake. And even though I actually kind of like the, uh, uh, the Legend of Spiral the Dragon of the camera, the camera, uh, even if some people don't like it, uh, if only because of how unspiro it may be, as well as just certain complaints, I like it. It's good enough. It's good enough for me, boys and girls. Eh. Then again, I'm also one to usually be a little bit forgiving with games. Ha ha ha. I know, that would be hilarious. That might be a little bit hilarious coming from me and my harsh criticisms of certain parts of certain games. I shall not say anything because I don't know when certain things are being uploaded because, oh yeah, that's another thing I need to touch on. I am going to try and uh, have a wider variety of things posting at different times, like instead of one game uh, being posted Three times a week. Path of you free Rastor. dragons. Pass through this fancy vortex uh, thingamajigger. It'll take you back to the artisan home. But first, let me tell you a story. No thanks. See ya. Obvious. Aha. If Death Battle ever does a Death Battle Spiral, they have to remember he can teleport dragons away at just a thought. Or else, why wouldn't the guy say words? But yeah. Uh, I'm going to try and have more than just, uh, ah, noise, the sound effects playing, hurts my ears, stop it, ow, ah! don't know why I kept playing the sound effect, but I'm going to have some more variety if I can, like, maybe 
two or three games to cycle between of the, Watch the dragon Gavin, what spot. are you doing outside of Spyro of what of a Chima Hunter? When he and slow mo guys. Flies, he strong, Why are you a dragon? Like me. Uh sure. We all know Gavin, Gavin Oh yeah. I have no idea why that's a thing that's, that amuses me. Alright, I think I missed some gems. We are missing eight germs. They shall not escape me. They shall not. Okay. Oh, what was I saying? I keep getting distracted by things. But yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is a reboot of a previous Let's Play done on emulation because I'm a Nazi boy. And as well as Ball, going to be uploading alongside Kingdom Hearts. Eh, I might as well mention it here because it's probably going to be uploaded long, long before the current uh, episode of Kingdom Hearts. Considering that Kingdom Hearts is now 10 hours long in gameplay length already, so. But hey, lots of things to look forward to. So. Da -da -da. Just, yeah, just more things. I probably won't upload uh, once every day of the week, mainly because I don't want to flood. And boxes with things that not many people are gonna watch. Maybe if a viewership picks up, then I'll stop po uh, posting more. But these are just kind of for my benefit, where I get to play games and feel like I'm actually doing something besides just playing games, kind of thing. Basically, the excuse that a lot of reaction channels have. I might as well make content out of what I like to do. So that's my excuse too. Only mine's more legitimate. Because they actually talk. Well, hey. Alright, we're missing three more gems. Insert a Steven Universe or Jim in the Holograms reference here. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I like the music. The music. Eh, small technical glitches. I like the music for this game. Makes me wonder uh, how good the rest of the work of the police is if it, this is what the drummer alone can make. Ah, treasure chest! Just off in the wild. Well, hey. Well, off we go. Bop, bop. It's level one down in 20 minutes. Nice. I, this game just flows well for me. Even, just like it. It's a nice classic. And a cool thing is, if you kill these guys now, you get little orby things. These orby things essentially uh, go towards your extra life. Bop. So if you die, you go to the next life. Get back here. You stole pieces of my soul and I take them back so that I can reincarnate myself. Little do you know, Spyro is a cat dragon. In this way. Do -do -do. Do -do -do. Dark Hollow. Okay. Was I all saying anything that got cut off? I can't remember. Well, I'm, oh yeah. <laughs> I forgot. For whatever reason, I forgot to mention the thing that I was going to mention, which was uh, because my uh, Kingdom Hearts Let's Play has uh, reached an astronomical amount of time already spent on it. Ugh. Going to start creating, like, maybe put a little bit more effort into things, like the thumbnails and even just the naming convention. It just feels, I... 
I got squashed. And that's the first thing. That is how you get more health. Feed butterflies to your ally. The dragonfly. Bung. No Bungo, the giant ogre dude. No. And Bungo, the giant ogre dude, is now dead and no one mourns him. Let's... Bungo. Also, you wasted Jim's help. You wasted gems creating these fools. How dare you, Darius? Big enemies like this Gnork with the club cannot be charged, but a quick flame that should defeat them. A Nork, you Gnork. Give me those gems. Give me the gems, Jim. And the holograms, too. Dang it. It just feels like the flame button should be square instead of circle. All those years of using uh, 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 Xbox controllers, it's just like... It just feels right to click that button for charge. Yeah, it just isn't there the world. It is wrong! It is wrong! How doth we got there? We must do parkour! Got a stupid camera. Well, hey. No, yeah. Didn't show that. Just little things like that. That's cool. They could just had a basket. They have things inside the basket. It is you from the future, but only if you die. Oi. Oh yeah, that reminds me. How do I get over there again for that one, two gym, gym? Gym jam? Gym jam the magic dragon? I think I will. Oh, maybe. I hate the camera sometimes. But hey. Yeah, so I just have to do the same thing, but over there. It's been so long. Nice to revisit this. Whoop. Now that's what I call an atomic drop. Oh! I like how he doesn't actually damage you. He just bounces you. Jerk. Stay turned around so I may murder you and your family, and then take your noise. Oh, <laughs> and take your family's corpses back to the horde. Also, this means that nasty Nork had to have uh, plundered our beloved uh, horde and taken all these and try alchemized them into things. Oswin. Spyro, want to know a secret? Use the triangle button when you want to zoom in and look around. Oh, your secret's safe with me. These interactions some can sometimes be weird. Well, drop. <laughs> of course, the one thing Sparks will not pick up. A key. He abhors uh, locking things away. Why all those years locked in a cage will do that to you. We'll set the music uh, fades away and then comes back. Oh well. Kill the frogs. The frog is dead. No mystical prince to save you now, nasty Ganork. None. Ah, uh, just one of the pieces so was like, it looked like a thing I could collect. It was all shiny and it just left me. It's sad. I just love the design of everything. It's cool. Ah, uh, wrong button. Pop. Bunk. Bunk. 
instead of creating all these little ones and putting little shields on them, why didn't Nasty Nork create a lot of big ones and just put armor all around them? Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if Albon. Those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of them. This is nice for all the kids back in the early days of uh, everything that wouldn't have been able to figure out. It's just like, how do I defeat these guys? Uh, bug! Go away, bug! I cannot kill the bug, it is too fast, but... Yeah, these little hints are actually really good for uh, people that, <laughs> that... Well, that was fast, <laughs> but uh, it's very good for people that couldn't have uh, figured it out on their own. It's nice. But it doesn't just give it to them, they actually have to get to those uh, dragons first. Alright. At this pace, I'll be able to... Well, then again, this is just the first world. Don't be go getting cocky now, kid. This is just the first world. The artisan worlds. 